Today's video will be surprisingly simple. The two attacks you're going to want to use to defend yourself as Ultimecia are her forward bravery in the air and her dash attack on the ground. Her backwards bravery in the air can be used if you see someone's coming at you from a distance, so you can set up a, a little bit of uh, projectiles for them to waste their dash gauge trying to avoid. Other than that, you're not really going to be using this one at close range and you really need to get them away from you. Instead, you're going to use her dash attack or her forward bravery air attack. Why? Because these two attacks are big and fast. And let it be known that her dash attack has pretty low projectile priority, Meaning that most assassins can just barrel through it if they time their attacks right, but a lot of them don't, and the way her dash attack works, you can usually hit somebody way above you with it, due to how tall it is. The majority of the time you're probably going to end up using the dash attack because people are going to be above you, trying to assess you from above, trying to drop down on you. In that case, you just throw the dash attack while retreating constantly and eventually it'll probably hit him. This is the best way to defend yourself as her, which sounds a little odd, but you know, that's just how it is. If they're all up in your face and you got nothing else to do, usually the delay will screw people up, which she ducks down and throws her hand up and throws out the giant spears. So that's why this is usually your go-to if somebody's too close to you. You can, of course, land any attack you want with proper timing and good reads, but this is the easiest one to land, in my opinion. Now, the reason why her forward air bravery is one I recommend as well is because it virtually has no startup time when you actually see it coming. She has to cast it, sure, and hold it and charge it, but once she actually launches it, there's almost, it's just like this. It's just instantly like a neutral bravery attack for an assassin. It just comes out almost instantly. And it's pretty big too. It's not like a little projectile like a neutral fire from Terra or a rage fire from Shantoto. It's a big projectile for how fast it comes out and how big it can be. The longer you charge it, of course, the stronger it gets and the faster it goes out. But you can use that charge rather than a damage booster as a timing kind of cheese mechanic where you can time it correctly and then screw up an assassin who's coming at you or a vanguard or a marksman and throw them off so when you see their attack about to start up you can just throw it out immediately and hit them before their attack even comes out and it gets to their active frames or they can just take it in the face and then just knock them away you need to be level with them of course to use it because it, sh it shoots out straight that's all it does it doesn't like go up like the dash attack does it's very linear but it's still very good for how fast it comes out with almost no warning. They have to time their dodge right or waste dashing to the left or right constantly to avoid getting hit by this thing. If you don't think it's good, try to enter a lobby with a friend playing Ultimate who just spams those two attacks. Seriously, they're both really good and hard to dodge. They use the dash attack when you're on the ground and someone's above you or very close to you, and then use the forward bravery attack when someone's close to you as well, but you're in the air. You can mix it up, try to, you know, trick them up too. Don't just do one or you'll become pretty obvious and people will start barreling through the attack using the one strategy they can. But anyways, I'm Blue the Hedgehog. I'll see you guys next time. Make sure not to jump too high when using the four bravery in the air. And ta-ta for now.